Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. Just got a really interesting email in from Frederick about the new Nikon mirrorless. Actually, he was reading an article over on DIY Photography and uh, they were saying that the camera is ugly. So Frederick says, uh, hey Matt, I was just checking out the article over on DIY Photography titled, The Nikon mirrorless camera is pretty ugly judging by new leaked photos. And I was kind of surprised at the author's take on the camera, namely that it was ugly. From what I've seen from the photos, I think it looks pretty good. Certainly not ugly. He does make an interesting point about the design possibly being aimed at addressing a lot of people's complaints about mirrorless bodies being too small for the average person's hands, which also makes me wonder if by ugly, he means he's thinking the camera is too big for a mirrorless. Wondering what your take is on this. Thanks, Frederick. Well, thanks for your... Uh email there, Frederick. Uh, it was interesting. I hadn't seen the article till you wrote in. I went over and checked it out. I just popped over here and here is the article. And it's on, as, it says, as he said, on DIY Photography. This is by John Aldred. And we've got the, the basic photos we've seen leaked here. And um, he says, uh, so far, it's kind of funny looking. And he says, this new Nikon mirrorless camera looks pretty ugly from looking at these leaked photos. And uh, I would have to agree with Frederick. I mean, I've seen all these photos, and I don't see uh, how this camera is ugly looking. I will say that in this photo here, this more close-up one, I don't necessarily think the lens looks all that attractive, and perhaps that's because it looks like it's probably a less expensive uh, kit lens that isn't an internal zooming lens. It just looks like a cheaper kit lens. But the camera itself, to me here, does not look unattractive. Uh, and then... As uh, Frederick had pointed out, he says um, that uh, many users complain about Sony and other small mirrorless bodies not feeling as comfortable as their DSLRs did, that they're too small if you have anything but the smallest hands. So handling-wise, it might work out pretty well. So he's, he's thinking that maybe the design that he doesn't like is um, to resolve the issue of people finding mirrorless cameras too small, uh, which hasn't been a huge complaint of mine, but I know certain people it has, but I know Kirk Tuck over on the Visual Science Lab, I know he doesn't tend to prefer too small, he thinks it, it's it's not necessary to be mirrorless to be that small, um, certainly isn't necessary to be that small and light, I mean with the compounds and the alloys available, we don't need a camera to be super small just to be light, um, and uh, so John again is saying here, especially with that big grip, you can see some of the Nikon DSLR design influence. The lens mount is absolutely huge too. So, um, you know, it could have been, could be a combination here on size of needing that, they're, they're going with that new mount, the bigger mount, which should open up a world of possibilities for lenses. And maybe they are addressing, you know, there's been, um, I'm not going to say a lot, but quite a few complaints. Well, maybe it is a lot of people thinking the DSLR, uh, mir or not DSLRs, mirrorless bodies have been uh, too small. So just kind of curious, uh, what do you think of the article that Frederick's pointed out here over on DIY Photography, the, the premise that the camera is ugly? First of all, I don't think it is. I, I think the camera looks pretty good. As I said, a couple of lenses don't look that intriguing to me, but the camera body itself looks good. But what do you guys think? Do you think the camera's ugly? Let me know in the comments below. Is the new Nikon, the leaked photos of the new Nikon full-frame mirrorless, do you think they're ugly? Secondly, do you think it's more that the author here, John, is just pointing towards um, the size? Is his saying it's ugly or funny looking because he's used to, as a lot of people are, mirrorless being very small and that this Nikon is obviously not super tiny. Uh, is it an issue for you? Do you? Would you prefer the Nikon be actually smaller? Or are you happy that we're actually getting to a camera that's built for more regular sized hands that you don't have to feel like you need child's hands to play with the buttons? Let me know in the comments below. What do you think about the look of the camera? What do you think about the size? And do you think the size is influenced by previous complaints about mirrorless cameras being too small. Let me know. Interested to hear what you guys have to say in the comments below. Thanks for your uh, comments there in your email, Frederick. Very uh, interesting uh, and got me to read an interesting article there, uh, as I'm sure a lot of you guys will check it out. Looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say. Thanks, Frederick. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.